Hello, and welcome back to Like a Dragon Infinite Wealth. So, Aloha. before I continue anything, I will go over this in case you have skipped to this episode because the last one said sidetracked, which is understandable. Uh, not everyone cares about that. There is plot in the last one. Very important plot. Like, super important plot. Uh, and I put it in, in the description, in the timestamp. Uh, so, if you're tr wondering where that plot moment happened, it's it's right there. Uh, definitely go back and check that, because in the last one, which I will swell now, uh, <clears throat> uh, we... Well, first of all, we did a Japanese samurai quest, subquest, which there are a lot of subquests, but that is the only one we did in the last episode. And then we went back and did plot, and we basically were just hanging out, and Kiryu finally admitted uh, that the trailer wasn't lying, and cancer is on the table. He, he has it. Uh, so, yeah, we kind of had a little moment of breakdown for Ichiban trying to accept that. Uh, after that, we... We went to go upgrade our weapons. We met Julie uh, for Julie's workshop, and she was... Definitely a, li a likable character. I can't wait to actually do that little... I'm, I'm assuming she's going to have a subquest at some point. But yeah, we, we did that. We met her. We I had to write the list down because I've done... That was a long episode. Upgraded. We looked around this entire mall. Just full, fully explored, which I might have overexplored a little bit. And then we ended up finding the Sujiman professor here. And that led to what, like 30 minutes almost of learning about Sujiman training and capturing and battling and stuff. So that is the thing I'm going to put on hold until after we get main story out of the way in this episode. I really enjoy all of the optional content in this game and I can't wait to do it all, but I really want to do a little more story and like actually do story this time because the plot has been missing this whole time it feels like someone's always trying to pull us aside and be like hey how about this how about crazy eats how about Sujiman? which is great i love it but i want to see a little more story just just a little more story before we start running off and doing that uh they said we need two star equipment for the next plot thing and i don't quite have that right now i'm gonna give it to ichiban and maybe Kiryu. Thank you. There's a problem with this because my weapons aren't two star, and I don't think it's required. My weapons and my shoes aren't two star. His weapon is two star. The hero's bat isn't, but it's upgraded enough that it's better than any two star at, at, at its base level. So I think that this is fine, probably. And we're also supposed to be level 13. And we're level 15 right now, so we're a little we're a little ahead of the game. No, no, ignore, 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 get out. I think we're gonna be fine though. That's my my point. Uh, stay, stay away, stay away. Don't get distracted. Don't fight me. Don't get distracted. I just want to get out of this mall. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm going to have so many sidetracked episodes that, oh my, there's a raid over, active for six minutes? Oh. Uh, well, uh, uh, no, no, don't, don't, don't think about it. Okay, we're moving on, we're moving on. Um, we need to go over here, and all that matters is plot right now. What is that? Oh my god, is that another gotcha machine? I'm get on. You have no idea. Well, you, you probably do. I mean, if you're anything like me when it comes to playing games and like your ooh piece of candy moments, there are too many of them right now. Okay. This is District 5? Really? Huh. Smaller than I thought. Hey, you there. What do you want? Sub hmm? Let me just pick this stuff up. This is the least distracted I can get. Boomerang briefs. 
Someone else might already have had their fun with these. What is the... What is the purpose? Critical hit rate by two. Oh. Can we... I hope we can, like, craft... Uh, accessories and stuff, too. That would be sweet at some point. Yeah, this game already has so much going for it. Like, I have nothing but praise to say, except for the fact that I am mentally unprepared for so overwhelming... Hmm? Overwhelmingly, like, much to do. There's so much. My god. Wait for Roman? I should probably save. Okay. This is the gate to you, the uh, D District 5. We've got a bit of time before the meeting. Mm, do we just wait around for Roman? I have a feeling that it's gonna hurt. It's gonna hurt. But I like to do things under-leveled versus over-leveled. And if a fight goes on for too long, don't worry, I'll edit it a little bit. But I like a little bit of challenge. Yeah. Hey, you made it. Finally feel like doing your job for once. <laughs> Piss off. So you can really get us into District 5? Call me out all you want. Either way, it's time. No more of this standing around. Let's go. Besides, he's our only lead right now. He got me there. Well, after you, Roman. <laughs> Isn't this like the worst? Shit. You sure it's cool if we're here? Here's a question. What the hell you want with District 5 anyway? The most suspicious. Stolen. Guess the thief used it as a bargaining chip to get inside. Huh. Well, you're wasting your time then. Once something's in the Barracuda's hands, getting it back is practically suicide. I'm actually after the person who stole it. I'm gonna catch him and ask a few questions. Oh, that right? Hey, what's the holdup? Get this thing open already. Who the fuck are they? Uh, just some Japanese tourists with more money than sense. So they want to see a different side of Hawaii. <laughs> Come on. Not like you've got anything to hide in there, right? Open the gate. I have a feeling Roman's dead. Okay, get your asses ready for a special guided tour. Oh my god. That was a lot of assault rifles. Oh. What? Uh, let's hope this tours a round trip situation, yeah? Don't lag behind. Unless you want to end up as a casualty. <laughs> uh. This place is actually intimidating. Oof. This area was slated for redevelopment, but it got delayed due to a dispute over who owns the land. Still, no matter what country you're in, once something's abandoned, the homeless come knocking. This place became a shanty town in the blink of an eye. It's close to a lot of tourist attractions, so the government's almost always trying to clear it out. But with people coming in from all over the world, their little game of cat and mouse just keeps on going. Then the Barracudas rolled in, and, well, you can see how that turned out. Yeah, Hawaii's the last place I'd expect something like this. You would think, but a lot of these people come here on a one-way trip. They give their passports to the Barracudas in exchange for a stable place to live. But if they give up their passports, then how do they get back home? They don't go back home. District 5's got everything they could ever want. Shops, a hospital, cafeteria. The Barracudas have set up their own laws and infrastructure here. Safety. From the government's point of view, it's more convenient for the homeless to be under Barracuda control than to let them roam the streets. Yeah, but doesn't it cost money to use the shops and all? 
Where are these people getting the money? Ah, uh, they have their ways. So, you got any leads on your passport thief? Yeah, she's a 20-something Japanese woman. Her name's Chitose, kind of hard-headed. <laughs> yeah, sure. That ought to narrow it down. It doesn't? Or maybe he was being sincere. It sounded sarcastic. Hey, did you see a Japanese woman come through here? Goes by Chitose? Japanese? I actually might know something about that. What do you got? A few days ago, some guys got into a scuffle over in West Block. Apparently a woman showed up out of the blue. Not every day you see a little Asian cutie like her in a dump like District 5. Anyway, she was all by herself with nowhere to stay and didn't have a mind to bring a tent. As you can guess, a fight broke out real quick over who got dibs in that one. Sure. Uh, who'd the gal end up staying with? Don't know. Wasn't there to see the mayhem. Best bet is to ask around West Block. <laughs> it just had to be West Block. Huh? What's West Block? A sector all the way at the ass end of District 5. A lot of bums like to drink and gamble there. Real rough crowd on a good day. You really think so? Is she gonna be okay? Actually, it's a smart move on her part. Pal up to the strongest guy on that end, and it's easy living from there on. Of course, yeah, sure. nothing comes for free. Even in a rat hole like this. <laughs> and you seriously call yourself a cop? Anyway, West Block's waiting. Let's go. I almost guarantee you she kicked both of their asses. And she's fine hey. on her own. She just seems like a badass. I, I don't know. That's the vibe I got immediately from her. I think... I think... I, I have no idea who she'd actually be. She seems like a cop, though. She also kind of reminds me of Kalru. A little bit. If we hang her right here, we'll end up in what they call West Block. Although Kaoru would be like 50 now. And she seemed like she was maybe 20. Yeah, yeah, they said like 20 something. From what our friend said, someone there won a fight for the. Uh, won the fight for Chitose. Also, Kaoru's Korean. <laughs> so, sorry, I'm just distracted. And as to who, that's for you to figure what? out. What? Oh, what? I thought you were supposed to be our guide. You think I'm bad. People in West Block are even worse. I try to avoid them whenever I can. <gasps> Besides, what's a trip without a few fun surprises? Fine, whatever. Oh, this place is... It's giving me the creeps, but I have to look around. What's going on around here? Still good to go. That soccer ball. You guys are eerily quiet. You know what you're lacking? Okay, that's not gonna fit the vibe. So when you hold R1, you actually walk slower than you do when you just barely touch the analog stick. All right, this isn't West Block. Hold on, let me look over here. Hang on, this says Tose. Oh, wait, Buster Holmes. Never mind. Got a pound mate flyer here? <laughs> we pound anyone. Your dream mate is only a call away. I mean, I can see why people are confused when they call this. Uh... Those slogans aren't exactly, hey, we'll keep you safe. Okay, there's nothing going on here. Gotcha. To go it that way? Sup? Hey there. You know a woman named Chitose? Uh, Chitose? Yeah! Okay, pick up. Ah. Ah, this guy's trash, man. Chitose? Oh, the girl. I haven't seen a babe like that in ages. I got knocked out real quick. <laughs> Yeah, we heard about the brawl. Who came out on top? Yeah. How should I know? I didn't give a rip once I lost. 
So you don't have any clue as to who it might have been? Uh -huh. uh, look, buddy, I ain't a fan of all these questions, you dig? Look, just work with us a little. Kiri-san, can you spare some change? Thank you. Uh, thanks, man. Here, get yourself another cold one on us. <clears throat> Try the dude working out over there. Yeah. Got he sobered up. Damn, look at the size of him. Size, size of him. A uh, good chance he won the battle royale. Let's see what he has to say. Uh, sorry about the money, Kiri-san. I'll make sure to pay you back. Not quite. Would you give him a quarter? It wasn't necessary. I'll just put it on my tab with the Taitoji. I hope Hanoa joins us. He should be a party member. I'd love it. Uh, also, I've heard from people that there's a good chance he is uh, Mori. I forgot the guy from Five. What was his name? I, I've done the comparison in the in the faces. I know it's the same voice as the guy from Five. Fine then. I just don't see it in the face at all, which made, threw me off about Hanawa. But then again, you know, it wouldn't be that strange for them to do that. There's a lot of survivor stories, but Hanawa, I'm very curious about. I hope we get to learn more in this game. Rain. Sup? Is it Mori Naga? Hey, you the guy Chisose's staying with? Get lost. And great, this one's a charmer too, eh? Sup? What was that? Oh, I, I meant, uh... Hi. We're looking for a woman named Chisose. You know where she might be? Uh, who's asking? Listen, I'm sure we don't have to tell you that surviving out here is about brains over brawn. What? What? Uh, so what's your intuition telling you? Is fighting us really the right call? <laughs> hmm. What do you want to know? Like we said, we're trying to find a woman named Chitose. A fight broke out over her, right? We need to know where she ended uh. up. Ah, then you're going to want to talk to it. H Jose? Jose? H Jose. What? Is anyone actually pronounce it Jose? Or is that just in Persona 5 Royal? <laughs> it's like the only time I've heard Jose, and it's confused me from there on. So he's the big winner, huh? Where's his tent? We're making a lot of assumptions. Hey, watch it. Cocky attitude like that'll kill you. Uh, Kiryu-san. Thanks, Kiryu-san. I thought we were screwed for a sec. Hey, that would have been on you. For real. You really pushed the guy's button. But I'm glad we're all right. Way to keep things cool like usual, Kiryu-san. Just be glad he was understanding. Now let's go find I this... I get you. Uh, Jose guy. Uh, right, we're off. Clouds are gone. Wait, are you new? What? <laughs> Couldn't help it over here. You're looking for Jose's tent, right? Yeah, what? You know something? Jose's got everyone jealous these days. He's been courting that little lady, you know. Mm -hmm. Courting? I'm saying those two are a thing now. <laughs> oh. Why don't I believe you? Is it because I want to believe that she kicked both their asses and she's just a badass? Although she is kind of a seductrist. She might have just let him win. And uh, we'll see. Uh, all he does is brag about her. Keeps saying he's going to marry her and have kids. The whole nine yards. So, where is he then? Tent all the way at the end with the deck chair. Why'd you give us that info for free? If you plan to speak with him, I suggest you watch back. He's quirky. <laughs> Thanks. Good to know. So this Jose's really beat that big buff dude? D just don't set him off, all right? I won't. <laughs> <laughs> you sure? Anyway, let's go. 
I need to hear Tomizawa more. Not that I'm really, like, trying to do voices, but I'd like to differentiate him a bit. <laughs> Just a slight. Who the hell are you? You Japanese? That is not a you voice for that. Right? We're looking for a woman named Chitose. You know her? You got a thing for my girl? You just say his girl? Look, I'm not here to mess with whatever you got going on. I just want to ask her something. So, can I see her? <laughs> Buzz off. I decide who she sees, and I say no. Come on, man, this is important. The girl stole my passport. I just want it back. I see. You're from the outside and came to steal her back, that it? No wonder I didn't recognize you. Well, you better think twice, pal. No way I'm letting that sweet little thing go. Man, what part of I just want my passport do you not get? Open your ears. I just want to ask her something and go. We're done here. Hey, boys! You got a really clean voice for, like, not matching your face. Get rid of face. these clowns! Hey, hang on! We got the police with us! Hey, Roman! Do something, will ya? <laughs> like I'd throw myself between a gang of homeless goons and some no-name foreigners. I only serve the American public, friendo. I am an American, you ass! <laughs> Gosh, you full of shit! Yeah, well, you brought this on yourselves. But hey, best of luck. If you pull through, we'll keep on with the tour. No, oh. sure you, son. How are you holding up? Aside from wishing I'd kept my mouth shut, might help to stop asking how I'm doing every five seconds. Hey, can you blame me? Don't worry about me. Let's just end this quick. Right. I mean, it's true. Oh, cool. I could do this. I could do this. Now, have at him. Yeah, he... <laughs> Don't get smart with me. I feel like okay. he needs a it. way dirtier voice. Like, yeah, let's go. Let's have go. at you. Boys, get him. Or something like that. But instead, it's like super smooth. Uh, that's the voice of like... I don't know. Something wrong. Here I come. We'll go for you. Armed and ready. It's a new song? I really need to like listen to the music. Time to put you down. This this does sound like a new battle track. What is your name? How do you pronounce that? Allow me. Kan Anyan The guy who's bleeding right now. How do you pronounce that? Ka Anyanya. <laughs> I'm so sorry. It's over. Let's get it done. Oh, paralysis. It's not kicking in. Ooh, weak to ice. Oh, you died to bleeding. Rip. Oh, you get a, get a kick. Um, yeah, if you could just... Uh, damn it. Oh, there we go. Oh, it's over. Who knew I had it in me? All right, Jose son. <sighs> if you're really in love with Chitose, you gotta choose your words carefully. Understand? Doesn't, doesn't even know. Huh? For starters, don't ever call her your girl, not even by accident. You don't want to mess up like I did, right? Uh, sure. So, where's Chitose? Uh, well, you see, she, well, she ran off. Mm hmm She ran off? It was that first night. She was offering me drinks. 
got a little carried away and sipped one too many. I've heard that story before. Hey, she drugged me, okay? And wait, if that happened on the first night, then... He's been lying. All right, look, I didn't bang her or nothing. You happy? She was gone before I knew it. Uh, yeah, you still went around bragging like she was your property. What an asshole. Anyway, then what? She was asking me about the Barracudas and how she could meet them and whatnot. So I told her how to get to the underside. Wait, you told some girl who just wandered in how to get into the underside? More like I let it slip out. Yeah. Arrest him. Oh, idiot. Well, hold up. What's the underside? Sorry, boys. The tour's over. Just, just forget about the girl. Oh man, wouldn't that be nice? <laughs> but we come too far. What the hell's the underside? You pipe down, you moron. Look, let's just call it here. You stick your neck out any further, and the axe is gonna fall real fast. We can't do that. I'm taking back what's rightfully mine, and she's got some answers to give. We don't have much time. If Chitos is in this underside, then show us how to get there. Sorry, but you don't get a say in this. Dude, he looks like he's sweating so Fine. bad. But promise me one thing. From here on, no more funny business, you hear me? You move when I say so, and keep your mouths shut. That depends on what kind of place we're going. Now, show us the way. Shit. Okay. Follow me. That was a very good response. Okay, so... Y you hey, know what I'm actually Roman, taking away from that? You talk about the underside. Is it really that bad? Oh, what? The scowl on my face didn't clue you in enough? Come on, let's just try to get along. You know, I'd be a lot more agreeable if you just gave up. That'd be easier, sure. But this isn't a game for us. Oh, is that right? Then at least shut up. Uh, what I am taking away from this is that guy actually did beat up the macho dude. Uh, and Tutose seduced him. I thought that she kicked his ass, but... Man. I'm just praying that she's, like, the strongest character in the party. She shows up and she's the new Aerie. We're she's going like... down. Party of four. Okay, Aerie wasn't the Lost strongest. Easy, but... okay? Don't give me that shit. You want me to take you out of here in cuffs? Uh-oh. This is it. A gateway to a damn near parallel universe. How many sewers have we gone down? A uh, sewer, huh? I thought <laughs> you said parallel universe. Just stick close, smartass. Oh my god, please make it a giant underground city. I bet he is Hades. Roman, Gatekeeper of the underworld. What the hell do you want? Nothing. Just a bit of sightseeing. And who are they? Sightseers. What else? Okay, hold on. You even run this by the boss? Hey, do me a solid, won't you? I promise. We'll behave. Whoa. What is that? Ten bucks? Fifteen bucks? <laughs> Behavior only gets you so far. Is this? Oh, wait, what? <laughs> okay, this is better than I thought. Damn. The Anaconda Shopping Center? I see. 
So this is the underside of District 5. It used to be an air raid shelter, built after you boys bombed our asses at Pearl Harbor. But it went untouched, and now it's just another relic of the war. Fast forward a half century to when the Barracudas came across it. Remodeled it in no time flat. <laughs> Why'd they want to recreate a big famous mall underground now? That's and a good point. who the heck are all these customers? Who's doing their shopping down here? Take a closer look. A fashion show? Whew. Designer brand, too. She's all decked out. Uh, is she? Oh, you serious, dude? The code itself is easily worth 10 grand. I can't tell. And them? What are they doing? Bidding. The stuff she's wearing is the merch, and the audience surrounding her is the buyers. The, but, but then, why would anyone come down here just to shop? Uh, hang on a sec. Is all this stuff stolen? <laughs> I'd say stolen's putting it lightly. Everything you see here, no matter how real it looks, is a District 5 original. Made in-house. Uh, they're knockoffs? Oh, they're more than just your average knockoffs. These are perfect replicas, down to the very last stitch. Patterns on the fabric included. Crazy bastards smuggle it out of the actual factories. How? I have no idea. That is crazy. One could almost say they do designer brands better than the designers. And that's what makes this the greatest counterfeit market on Earth. Hmm. As well as the biggest. So we have another counterfeit scheme going on. The world's biggest counterfeit market. And the buyers? They're aware of that? Of course. And not only that, but they're legitimate employees. They're the actual buyers for the department stores you know and love. They come in from the mainland, Japan, heck, all over the world. You mean everything they buy here goes up on the shelves? Yeah, the buyers pass them off as the real thing and sell it straight to the stores themselves. And the difference in price goes directly into their pockets. A single trip could net them hundreds of thousands of dollars. No matter how good of a buyer you are, I'm sure it's hard to resist the appeal. Meanwhile, the customers don't have a clue. They throw money left and right without even batting an eye. The best what? part is, they don't even care if it's real or not. Why would you? For most of these people, all that matters is that they bought an expensive brand from a famous department store. The act itself is what keeps them going. Uh, wait. Uh, here's the question. How'd all these people even get down here? You telling me they trudge through the sewers dressed like that? <laughs> They have their own special way in. Can't tell you more than that, though. Is everything in that window a counterfeit, too? Yep. They've got a factory pumping this stuff out 24-7. I see. And they're putting the homeless up top to work. Bingo. The payout right sucks, but it's enough to make it by in District 5. Well, it's wild. I'll give you that. But still, where the heck's Jitose? I don't see her here. Well, let's dig a little deeper. Yeah, I don't know how this is related to the Barracuda. I mean, I, I get that they're, like, running this, but, like, I see no Mafia stuff going on here. So this is where they cook up all the counterfeits. Looks like no one's home. I thought it's supposed to be running 24-7. Yeah, it's supposed to be. Oh, Roman! Uh -oh. Hey, who got there with you? Oh, these guys? <laughs> they're, they're, they're no one. Anyway, what happened here? He's dead. You shut the whole place down? Yeah, didn't want to stain the merchandise. Stain it? <laughs> oh, come on, man. You don't think that I would come <laughs> Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Really thought you could bring in outsiders to the 
core of our operation, Vendeo. Man. I take it you're no ordinary tourists. Now start talking. Or would you rather spill your guts for real? All right. We're looking for a girl named Chitose. You ever heard of her? Kill him. That's it? That, that wasn't even a yes or no. I'll that was just a... Why okay. did you ask the you question? Okay. Time. This is actually... They're way more brutal than the, any of the last games that I remember. I don't remember them being that brutal. You just walked up, knifed him, and then the... Ugh. Uh, not that that's a problem, but like, I... My god. It's certainly on another level. <laughs> um, will this hit? Something wrong? This will hit three. That'll hit two. This will hit three. I want to get rid of most of them because I'm barely at level here. I guess I'll hit the three next to me. Oh, good. We killed him off. This guy didn't even have a name. Nameless dude just killed the cop. I saw, saw it coming. Now. The second he started like telling us everything, it was like, yeah. You're you're dead. Here we go. Hmm. I'm gonna beast mode you. Stunned. Oh he does have a name. Enoa. Enoa. Ready as I'll ever be. I didn't dodge anything. Uh, I should probably take it a bit Bring easy on my MP for the other two. Here I come. Armed and ready. That's a lot Let's of damage. Allow me. Hell yeah. <laughs> Let's go. Let's go. I really wish paralysis was proc. It doesn't seem to be proccing despite adding that thing onto the weapon, but oh well. Wait, do I even have the right weapon on? I hope I do. Yeah, I do. Damn it! Guess we ought to scram for now. No, we keep moving. What? If Chitose's here, then she'll be further in. Yeah, but bust down the door like that? We have no idea what's waiting for us. If we turn back now, we're not getting back in. He's right. Ah, oh, shit. Okay, fine. Right behind you. Let's go. All right, we're going right I'll back in. You. The battle is on. These two's mentality <laughs> is perfect. Don't get wrong. Uh, they're, they're definitely the two people who would absolutely agree with each other in a lot of circumstances. Gotcha now. Uh, 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 Ooh. Uh, what were you? Time. What were you worried about? You just killed three people. Here we go. Okay. Okay, I had a feeling. I think that's all of them. All right. No turning back now. Got to keep moving. Yeah. Glad to have you with us. What? What is that? Why does he have an infinity thingy? Is that? Is that the tag team bar? Uh, the. Actually, I don't even see it on this list. They have a tag team skill, right? We we've done it once. Double dragons, yeah. What what is the infinity bar that's only on Kiryu, and it's like partially filled now? Uh, 
That has not been introduced yet. Whatever it is. Um. Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna give him something. We're gonna just like sort by MP. Wait. Oh my god, sort by MP recovery. Thank you. Oh. Um, deluxe coffee. It works. Perfect. Thank not you. bad. Okay. What? Hi. Run on home to mama. Show me what you got. Foot soldiers. <laughs> let's go. Let's go. You're in it now. Do your work. What's the hold up? Um. <laughs> Look at this little piss baby. Oh, you're weak to it. You okay. You're out. Let's get it done. Oh, you're both weak. Allow me. Yeah, I don't have a tag team thing, so I think that the infinity thing must be the tag team meter I was wondering about. How does it fill? Okay, that that, that punch did not fill it, so... Hold on, I'm gonna check through uh, help info quick. Okay, so I haven't found anything about it in battle yet, so... Maybe, maybe it's something we don't know about, because, like... I'd be surprised if, uh, where was it? Oh yeah, critical hits, buffs, no, nothing. I'd be surprised if this, if it didn't have like the infinity symbol here, if that was the meter that was filling. Like, why wouldn't you tell me how these happen? Uh, the height meter, uh, according to this. What is the height meter? I don't know where the height meter is. <laughs> That good. easily, that easily could be it, though, uh, because it looks like you could just take that and put it on Tomizawa, too, to give him a height meter, but why doesn't uh, Ichiban have one? It's kind of weird that he, he wouldn't have one, because they both do the tag team. The hell you want? I'll help you rest it. Bring it on. I don't know. Allow me. We'll know once it filled, if I can press R2. Yeah. And... Oof. Okay, it's it's starting to fill. Gotcha. Suck on this. <laughs> Let's go. Let's go. I'm just hard staring at that meter now. I'm gotcha so curious now. about it. You're up. See you in hell. You have a win. Oh, well, I wish it would stay playing. Uh, yeah, go down here. You seriously? Piss you don't want to mess with me. Let's do it. What did we do to piss Allow you off? Me. You're done. This will piss you off. Oh, that was like let's 600 go, damage total. Damn. I'll take you on. Uh, hold on, hold on, hold on. Uh, get you. Nope, nope. Stop moving. Come on. Oh my God, I wish I could shortcut these, but Open I can't. Up. Oh. Home run. <laughs> Let's go. Let's go. Don't get caught. Set him with this. <laughs> I ain't even the we are making quite a bit of money. I'll be fine. Is that why I keep saying that? The cancer thing? Just I'll be fine. Just keep going. That's gotta be it. Ooh, a classic silver Should safe. Should I open it? Sweet. Good thing I didn't waste my money on shoes. Running shoes? Uh, agility up, please. Please. Oh, ho, ho. Yeah. Um, and... I don't really want him to lose agility. I'm going to give you this. I hope the music's not too quiet. It shouldn't be, but... So you actually made it this far, huh? Hey, boys, we got a few rats. Uh, these guys look tough. What's the plan, Kasuga? 
Let him come. It doesn't change a thing. We'll take him down and push on through. You're really pissing me off. The battle is on. That's kicking time. Guys, you have to have a better line than we're really pissing me off. Let's go. Like, how? Oh, that'll hit everyone, right? I think it will. Brace yourself. Here we go. Damn. Go. That guy has a shotgun? Oh, they both do. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, that's... Come on. They're not weak to anything. Um, let me use ice Here on you, then. Let's grab him. Oh, I missed it. Don't go rubber? Ow. Oh. Let's get it done. Well, that move seems pointless. Why would you shoot four of your bullets in the wrong direction? <laughs> All right. Oh. Allow me. Oh, come on. Bring it. Really Don't was hoping that would hit him, but. Ooh. All right, finish him. Ready as I'll ever be. Got you now. Armed and ready. See you in hell. Damn that even warmed good. up. Oh. How big is this place? Sheesh. Oh, beats me. Oh, don't do this. Oh. Uh, curious on. Too early. Hey, you okay? Yeah. That's it. I'm with I'm with Ichiban. Shoot, we got company. He's he's going to the Hide hospital after this. Where'd they go? They're gone. They've got to be in here. Find them. Hey, what are you doing? Let's move. Right. Lucky. <laughs> Sorry about that. Not trying to hold you back. <laughs> it ain't like that at all. What now, though? We've been winging it so far. We need a plan. <sighs> yeah, we do. Believe me, you're not the only one. <gasps> it's been a minute, Kasuka-san. How's Hawaii treating you? Chitose-san! <gasps> Chitose? You mean this is her? This is the girl that tricked you and stole your shit? More importantly, she's the only person who has a connection to Akane-san. I didn't expect her to come to us herself. These two are new to me. Friends of yours, Kasuka-san? I'm Chitose. Nice to meet you. Oh yeah, pleasure's all mine. So what are you even doing here? The surface is one thing, but this is something else. Well, I've got my reasons. But if you want the quick version, the Barracudas are after me. The Barracudas want you? The heck did you do? If I had to guess, it's because I know too much. About their counterfeiting gig? Huh? No, Akane-san. They're after her too, you know. Wait, they're what? Kasuga, don't you remember what Yamai said? Everyone was right. after her. I was also looking for Akane-san. Man, what the hell? What, is every lowlife on the island in on this? Chitose-chan, do you think you could tell us more? Also, how did she hide? How did she... <laughs> oh, oh, okay. 
Sure, I can tell you. Um, but maybe after a break first. You went through a lot to get here, right? What are you after? What's your problem? Don't give me that look. I'm just trying to be considerate. Oh, immediately Sayako and Nanba relationship here. Tree is absolutely a party member. Uh, yeah. Tomizawa, she's probably right. Let's cool it for a bit. I'm pretty Got tired it. myself. If you say so. Hey, looks like there's all sorts of useful stuff in here. Let me know when you're ready to move on. Oh. Oh, oh, I see. Okay, you're giving me a place to save and... Ooh, okay. That infinity symbol looked... Oh, it's close. I, I'm guessing it's actually the hype meter, and I'm just crazy. Uh, I don't know how I didn't notice it the first time. I'm just really upset that they didn't, like, put it in the tutorial page, saying, hey, here's your hype meter. This is what it looks like. Watch that, and when it fills, you're good. Because it's leading me to wonder too much. Oh. Okay. Yeah, that's that's probably fair. Um, will she join the party, though? Before that? Also, I'm going to guess. Hmm. Probably fights with the staff. I have no basis for this. Y you ever play Sifu? There's one enemy in Sifu who dresses like her, has like a short bun like that in like a, a short shirt, the way she does. And, well, it's not one enemy. It's a type of enemy in, in that game. <laughs> and they they fight with a staff, I believe. They have really long legs. It, they just remind me of her. That That's all. I think the first time you fight him is like the second area in that game, right in the beginning, pretty much. In case you're wondering who I'm talking about. I'm not going to spoil anything, but I, I, either way, hold on. All right, so talk to them before her. Hey there. You guys are probably tired out, aren't you? I'd say rest up rest up first. We can talk to her after. Ah. Fine. Pain in the ass, girl. Ha. Ah. <laughs> ha. Ah. Hello. I actually really like his VA. Uh, I also am liking hers, but I can't pinpoint who it is. I feel like I know them, but I feel like they might just sound similar to someone I know, and then I've never heard them before. It's weird. They got they got that kind of voice. Um, I don't want to look them up yet, because it might spoil, any, spoil something, but... Uh, finish napping. Napping? Uh -huh. Yeah. Yeah, so can you tell us the story now? Right. Probably should go through things in order. I was at Akane-san's four days a week. She hired me to do housework. You were a maid. About ten days ago. Actually, it's been twelve days. She up and disappeared without warning. Twelve days ago. Were there any signs you could see it coming? Nope. That day I went to her house like always, but the door was locked and nobody was home. I thought she just stepped out to run an errand or something, but the next day and the day after, she was still gone. Did you call the police at all? No. You see, exchange students in Hawaii aren't exactly allowed to have part-time jobs. If I'd reported it, they might have figured out I was working here illegally. Meaning, when I went to the house, the Kane-san was already long gone. So, wait, what were you still doing there? Kane-san never gave me my last paycheck, and it was a whole month's worth, too. Mm. I went in to get it for myself. Akane-san told me where she kept the money, and also how she had a spare key under the doormat. Sure enough, that was when you showed up. If that was the case, why didn't you just tell me what happened? <laughs> right, like you would have believed me with all that? <sighs> yeah, good point. If you reported me to the police, I'd have been screwed. That's trespassing and robbery. But you stripped him. All things considered, I had to get you out of there. And threw him on the beach. And that's why you got me wasted off my ass and dumped me on the beach? Eh, more or less. Okay, but was stripping me down really necessary? Thanks to you, my naked ass got jumped by the police. That was the plan. 
You'd be so caught up in trying to protect yourself, you wouldn't even have time to chase me down. Yes, that's one way to do it. Anyway, what are you doing here in District 5? Well... Oh, what? Don't clam up now! You guys gotta promise. Not a word of this to anyone else, okay? You want us to promise? You got any idea what we've been through? All right, we promise. Hey, uh, Kazuga! Sure, she might have set me up, but it's got nothing to do with the fact that she's got a secret to keep. Hmm. Right now, our priority is to find out what's going on. Yeah? <sighs> That's how you see it. I guess an outsider like me ought to hush up. Hey, you're anything but. Thanks, Tomizawa. All right, we promise to keep quiet. Can you tell us why you came? <sighs> okay. But remember, you don't tell anyone, got it? Got it. Don't sweat. The boss would always compliment me on how well I could keep a secret. Huh? Sure, whatever. The reason I came to District 5... It has to do with my family. Your family? Back in Japan? Do you know the name Fujinomiya at all? Uh, can't say I do. Hang on. The Fujinomiyas are major players in Japan's economy. <sighs> Figures one of you would know. If only everyone were more like Kasuga-san. Things wouldn't be so tough. <laughs> Sorry to hear that. So... <sighs> so... I'm the eldest daughter of the Fujinomiya family. Okay. And as it turns out, I'm the top candidate for their successor. Wait, so like, you're some super sheltered rich girl? Well, if you want to put a label on it, but yeah, basically. Sure, coming from a famous family has its perks. But in reality, they're all just a bunch of lunatics who will do whatever it takes to keep up the family name. That's a prestige thing, huh? That's not too different from the Yakuza. If you ratted me out to the police, and my family found out about my part-time job. Just thinking about it, I... It's terrifying. Why would you need one? Of course, I knew District 5 was dangerous coming in. But I heard that once you're inside, you can essentially disappear. Even the police can't get their hands on you. That's why after I got you zonged, I immediately skipped over here. Word around town was that you needed a passport to get in. Oh, so the reason you took all my stuff was partly to get at my passport. Yep, that's right. Yeah, I get it. It makes sense, but man, that's one reckless stunt you pulled. I, I was desperate, and it's not like I don't feel bad, you know? One thing I don't get. Your family's totally loaded, right? Thank you. Why would anyone bother to go through all that trouble for a month's pay at a part-time job? Your folks can just wire you however much you want, right? Here's the thought. Why do you think rich people actually get rich? No clue, actually. It's because they're stingy. That's true. That That is that is quite true. <clears throat> uh, but even... Th well, no, it's, it's the... I don't know. I don't know. It doesn't matter. Okay, I think I get why Chutose-san set me up. No, just need to figure out what did the Barracudas want with her. Yeah, why is she here specifically? Like, why did she go farther in? Hmm. There's a lot we want to know. Let's ask her when the time's right. Yo! Are you really okay with all you just heard? I mean, she basically pulled you into all this mess. Yeah... It's fine. Actually, there's nothing else to do. Huh. Kasuga wouldn't hold a grudge, although he, he definitely was pretty upset about the having to make him naked on the beach. It could have... Uh, I mean, she explained it all. It, it makes sense, honestly. Okay. Yeah, I got a few more things. Hmm. Well... 
It's pretty clear why you set up Kasuga. Next, let's hear about why the Barracudas are out to get you. I'm sure there's a story there. Okay, so apparently it's rare for someone like me to turn up around here. Soon as I entered District 5, they took me straight to the guy in charge. Wait, wait! You mean the Barracuda's boss? Yeah. And after we talked, he seemed to take a liking to me. Oh, yeah. Well, you don't look too unhappy about it. What then? Well, then, the boss decided to keep me at his hideout. And by keep, you mean... Look, I'm sure you can piece it together for yourself. Oof. Anything was better than having my family find out. At least, that's what I told myself. But it was kind of a bust. He never even made a move. I mean, maybe he's just been stressed out or something. Oh, <laughs> the hell do I say to that? They gave me a room and everything, but I was bored out of my mind in there. They told me not to leave the room, but I snuck out and explored a bit anyway. Next thing you know, I find this in the boss's study. Ooh. That's Every for Connie son. Everything's blurred. There's all kinds of info about her on here. Dress, phone number, height, facial features. Ew, hey, wait a, wait a second. You might had this too. Right. He's after her, same as these guys. What's it all mean? Why are all these gangsters chasing after Akane-san? I don't know. Hmm. But it's worth noting I found this in the trash. That probably means he doesn't need this anymore, right? More than that, couldn't it mean the Barracudas actually got to her? Ugh. With that in mind, I thought there might be a chance they were holding her somewhere nearby. That's a good That's point. That's why I started snooping around all their factories and stuff. But a bunch of lackeys caught on to me, and now I've been branded some kind of traitor. Long story short. Talk about reckless. Really, I'm just glad I was able to meet up with you guys. You're on the run too, right? Why not team up? I'll show you the way out of here. And in exchange, you guys will be my bodyguards. Sound good? Whoa, slow down a second, all right, princess? Kasuga, whatever you decide to do, I'm with you. The Barracuda's boss and I got a score to settle. And I say it's time. <sighs> All the more so. Now that Roman is dead. Yeah. Hear you, son? It's your call. I'll follow your lead. Okay, Chitose chan. Can you show us the way? But not the way out. I want to see the boss man first. What? Did you hear a word I said? What, you want to take the scenic route for this guy? No. Actually, I'm choosing this for myself. Akane-san might be my flesh and blood mom. And I'm not gonna abandon her. Simple as that. And if you're too scared to go back, could you at least point us in the right direction? Are you serious about this? Yeah. Truth be told, I'm worried about Akane-san too. If she hadn't hired me, I'd probably be face down in a gutter somewhere. Then... That said, there's no point in rushing to our deaths. If things get dangerous, we bail. Okay? Okay. I'm counting on you, Chi-chan. <laughs> I'm sorry, what? I knew it! Chi-chan! It's a nickname! <sighs> You've never had a girlfriend, have you? <laughs> Wait, don't you know that? <laughs> never mind. Let's do it, Ichiban. I was like, okay. what is he going to call her? Follow me. It was going to be Chichan. Kasuga. Hey, don't sweat it. I told you. I'm doing this one for me. Mind lending a hand? Right. Thanks. I thought maybe it would have been like Tosei-chan. That would, that would have made sense, but it's... I don't think you can really use the last half of a first name... Yeah, I, I don't know if it works the same like that. I mean, that would be like Bon, ca calling him Bon. It, it just doesn't really... I don't know. Uh, she's not joining the party yet? 
I know she's joining the party. And now that I hear him say princess to her, I am very much expecting, what was it, heiress? I don't know. I don't know if we actually have access to anything that tells us that. Uh, that the, the tiara. Someone was wearing like a tiara weapon. Well, not wearing it, but... Oh, it's right here. Yeah, the punk joker. That belongs to Eris, I believe. That's got to be your job. That, that's got to be it. You need to go after her. Yeah. I want to hear the cool join up music. Join the party. Join, join the party? Fine. Chichon. Well, that didn't take long. Stay back, Chichon. <laughs> my, my, such a gentleman. Unfortunately, I'm not really a damsel in distress type. Yeah. Hey, you're gonna fight too? I'm pretty quick on my feet, you know. Oh, trust me, I won't hold you back. Okay, good. She is a badass. Exactly as I was hoping. Huh, let's see what you got then. Take all the help you want, you're still gonna get slaughtered. I'll sue you! Show me what you got. Okay. I just do a back kick? What what oh. You're in it now. Oh, Palm on, tree pose? I hurry up. Ran I don't know how to say that. Jet? Jete? <laughs> uh oh hold on, hold on. Increases Let's attack go. and agility. Self only, okay. Flaws execution of a a ballet? Oh, yeah, that makes sense. Kind of like a ballet fighting stance. I'll take you on. Uh, ballet's most run. challenging That's leaps oh, it damages on. an enemy and applies the... Okay. A we heal. Okay. It seems to have a pretty damn big range, too. Huh. Bringing years of strict ballet training to the battlefield, damage an enemy, and apply the attribute. Plus grapple break, which is great. Catwalk trance? Per her indelible interest in fashion industries, the runway walk has a high chance to charm her enemies. AoE? That's a small AoE, but like, look at that. Ooh, you know, I I have to try it. You are mine. Not bad. All three of them? Let's get it done. Hell yeah! Uh, I want to see all of her moves right now. So. <laughs> Let's go. Charm is great. Uh, I'm only gonna fight you. Yeah, it doesn't even go away when you hit him. I love charm. Here we go. No, I'll punch you. That's fine. Don't hit it. I don't want to accidentally kill him. Okay, I'm up. Something wrong. Mm, let's see this one first. I don't want to hit both, but I think I'm going to. No matter. Oh, there Prepare we go. Yourself. Okay. That's kicking time. That was quite literally a ballet one. All right, guard. 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 <laughs> ah, shit. Well, I can't do that one. I'll do this just to see what it looks like. Okay, so she's she's really like quite literally a, a ballet style, which I don't know if that's a true fighting style, if there's a term for it or not, but doesn't seem to have that much MP. Thanks. What? Let's go. Let's go. Maybe I just spent too much. Here we go. I can do this. All right, I want to see this, and then we can just play the game like a normal human. Ooh, oh, okay. Okay, that's I'm the cool one. Into what? Uh, Oops, I didn't block that. Oh, no combo. Alright, I like her moves. Uh, damn it. Don't think you're getting out of here alive.
What? Oh, okay. Huh. Well, the hell? He flipped the security system. Looks like those lasers mean business. We'll keep pushing through. Just be careful not to touch him, all right? Aye. Pay close attention to how they're moving. We're gonna have to time this just right. Uh, right, let's do it. What? Accompanying? No. No, you need to join... Okay, maybe we have to, like, finish this whole area before she decides to stay with us. Why don't we just hit the button again? <laughs> All right. Can I? I can't get on my scooter. Damn. Wait, was there any? Oh, there is something over here. Damn. Ooh. Let's get serious. Oh, that one's fast. Oh. Hey, careful, Kasuga. Keep slipping up like that and you're done for. We can't afford any missteps. Figure out the timing, then dash through all at once. Now, you're supposed to say, are you sure you were in soldier? The safety brooch. What is that? Plus 10 defense? Uh, that's, that's not too bad. Um... You already have a decent amount. I kind of think... Oh, oh, she's in the party. R regardless of what they say, th she is clearly in the party right now. Oh, Punk Choker. Oh! Caught Sphere. Keeping that around. Madam's Advisor? Lower damage from fire attack. Sure. Um, and... Seems like that's, uh, best shoes she can have right now. Uh, she seems to have... There's her stats. She has a lot of agility. When you compare that to everyone else, my god, you have 123 agility, everyone else is in their 80s. You have a decent amount of magic. I wouldn't say it's, like, outstanding or anything. And she's got good willpower. The The main thing she lacks is MP. MP, and I'm guessing uh, attack, because I put this on and it made her like way stronger than when you compare everyone else. They're using two-star with the same attack as her. So I'm guessing MP and attack are her low points. Uh, I probably want... Oh, she also has low HP. Yeah, she's kind of got mage HP. Let's give her a fighter band binding. I kind of want to give her some MP. Although magic up might be better. Or more willpower. No, uh, magic up. No. Yeah, yeah, it's fine. <laughs> Sorry, I, that was... I, I took a while there. I'm not even... Is this... Yeah, yeah, I, I don't know why I did that. That obviously wasn't... That's not gonna work either. There we go. Ooh, okay. So what if I, like... Okay, that works. Oh! Okay. That wasn't super bad. I'm still gonna heal though. And give you some MP back. Um, sort by MP recovery. Mm, Boop. Yummy. <laughs> the hell do you want? You're really pissing me off. Right, time to throw down. We're really pissing okay. them off. Are you getting scared? Uh, Let's go. Something wrong. Damn. The the other issue is she doesn't have any AoEs, so like catwalk seems like it's good at just saving me some uh, possible death, I guess. You're all mine. Not bad. Oh, I missed one, Let's but yeah. Now I know who to ignore, I'll just focus on the other guys. Open Oops. 
I didn't. I didn't mean to do that, but I, I, I clicked him. Well, got you now. Armed and ready. Here we time to take out the trap. Let's go. Oh. Well, they're still trying, so. Okay, I'm up. Whoa. She deals decent damage. Too. Seriously, that VA. Who is that VA? I feel like I have to know her. If she's been in anything else, I feel like I know her. Supreme Herb. I hate it because it's like so distracting that it feels like, yeah, you, you should just look it up. Uh-oh. That's going to distract me. <laughs> okay. They picked the perfect VA for her. Um, that's Yuffie in, in the FF7 remake. Yeah. Susie Young. I was literally just actually, yeah, I, I guess this would be releasing after I finished the uh, releasing that last episode. But I literally just talked about how good Susie Young is as a VA. Turns out she's also Chitose. Very, very good. Meaning, if there's any emotional scenes, uh, I guarantee she can pull it off. She has the ability. Still good to go. <laughs> what you looking at? Get ready for this. Bring it on. Okay, I'm up. Um. Get I'm just gonna hit him. For you. <laughs> Something wrong. Here we go. They are kind of spreading out now. I kind of want you to... No, you're too far away. Uh, I, I got a weapon attack. Man, it's oh, I was going to say, did he drop his weapon? Mm, I'm just going to draw breaker. You're out of here. Huh. She's kinda she's kinda has breakdancer autos. Think I'm getting stronger. That does remind me a lot of the breakdancer autos. Is is her current job like female breakdancer? Maybe it's not Eris. Oh, Should I open it? It wasn't very difficult. Got it. Ooh, what? What? It's worse than the one I have, though, as far as stars go. What do you have on you? Buff critical hit rate. Okay, so that'll that'll be good to upgrade. But right now, it is currently worse. Because I believe they said everything can be upgraded to, like, six-star uh, equivalent. Fine, then. At some point. Might be a natural okay. What are, you, what are you bragging about? You guys stood over here and did nothing. Oh, my God. Oh god. All right, some of these are a little uh a little good. I think the key is to just never hit sprint. Even though like some of these times some of these when I walk across them, I feel the urge like, "Oh no, I'm not going to make it hit sprint." Okay. Like that one. That one needed a sprint. What you looking at? I'll bury you. Let's do it. Okay, I'm up. How are we still going? How big is this place? Don't get caught. 
Let's go. Right, any of you, none of you need grapple. Uh, maybe I could knock one of you into. Nope. You want some of this? Let's go. Okay. Prepare yourself. Ooh, stricken with fear. Brace yourself. Oh, he's dead. Yeah. Here we go. I'm waiting. That is a lot of extra damage. Yeah, Time to yeah. put you down. Like Ichiban <laughs> hit for a hundred and ninety, and then it was like seventy, seventy, just yellow electric damage. All right, let's see if he's too scared to shoot. to the next level. Learning oh my more God. every day. I can hear Yuffie Doing now. Better than I thought. Hey, I'm even stronger now. I can I can absolutely hear Yuffie now, and like half of her lines. Uh oh. <sighs> Guess we made it out okay. Looks like we can take a break here. Let's lay low for a bit. All right, are we at the boss? Probably. Let me save. Got your back. All right. Oh. Hey, we're back at the shopping center. What happened to you taking us to the Barracuda's hideout? What do you mean, what happened? See that runway? Keep going past that, and there's an elevator that leads right to it. It's over there? Looks like it's deserted. We've got a clear shot. Okay, I guess we just sprint for it. I doubt any of these customers would try to attack us. I don't want to look. Nope, nope. It wasn't happening. <laughs> <laughs> A warm welcome to our impromptu guests. Now let's get this show on the road. First up, we got an all access look at our newest collection. Oh. That is not just hot. It's to die for. Damn it. Oh, hell yeah. You assholes call this a fashion show? We're not here to turn heads. But I'll be happy to oblige. I have to I have to do catwalk trance on the catwalk. You're all mine. Oh, come on. Break oh, what? Only me. 3 of them? Okay. You, you see they're they're all so consumed they're like trying to crowd around her. I love that. Sure, I'll uh, help you. Huh? Hold on, hold on. Got you now. <laughs> <You're right. laughs> Rip. All right, everyone's dead. In fact, they're so dead. I'm gonna don't use skills. Auto. <laughs> Here we go. <laughs> oh, the game just full. Okay, Wait. I'm up. Let's go. Guard. Let's get it done. Okay, you don't have a prompt. Allow me. You don't have a prompt either. Is, is the gauge not full? Come at me. The infinity gauge is full. What does it mean? What does it mean? <laughs> oh. Up next, a special treat just for you. Our prized autumn winter line. Little baggy. Okay. Ooh. Are you getting scared? Um. Oh, sure taking your time. Yeah, that'll hit three. Don't blame. Oh, only two. That's picking time. Okay, well, there's a good chance. Brace yourself. Please hit him. There's a good chance if I wasn't at full infinity and I was just like a pixel off that I'm there now. So here we go. 
No? Well, okay, maybe maybe I'm not. Ready. Maybe now? Now it's full. Okay, okay. Oh, come on. Bring it. <laughs> okay, I'm up. Now I might as well kill you. Let's get it done. Allow me. That is the symbol for tag team. Okay. Confirmed. I I'm actually gonna save it. I just wanted to know. Uh, cause we used it right away and it's been empty since like the last episode, so. I've been wondering about this for a while now. Yeah, hit him. And now the grand finale. Put your hands together for our top model extraordinaire. Uh oh. Showtime's over, boys and girls. Say your prayers. Okay. Hitman? No, no. Uh, what was his name? Were they just called Hangmen? I don't, I don't actually remember. You can't do anything, which is fine. Now they're stricken with fear. What I want to do is a grapple. I can't do a grapple right now. Hit him, I guess. Here we go. And then you guys need to line up. Please. No! No, get out of there! Oh, god damn it. I'm going into rush mode. I'm gonna try to push him back. There we go. Hey, you good? Okay! Take this fist and shove it! What? Let's go, let's go. That missed the other ones? Was that not a group attack? Oh my god, I thought for sure that was a group attack. Something wrong. Here I come. Uh, well, I'm waiting. I'm so I'm so upset that that was not a group attack. Okay, I'm up. Okay, um. I'll take you on. Nah, no, no, just attack him. <laughs> Follow my lead. Yeah. Oh, you're dead. Let's get it done. Open one. Oh, he, he's he's drowning right now. Got you now. You're done. I ain't even warmed up yet. All right. Who knew I had it in me? I think I'm getting better. Definitely like the little runway fight. Breaking, uh... Breaking the mold of the... You know. Get in. Warehouse so battles. where does this thing go? You'll see when we get there. The hell? Where are we? This is Crystal Aloha. Crystal Aloha? Crystal Aloha Resort Hotel. It's the swankiest hotel in Hawaii. What? <laughs> Crazy, right? This hotel's been top of its class for a hundred years. There's over 500 guest rooms, and the top floor's got views of the whole beach, all the way up to Diamond Head. It's practically the face of Hawaii. Man, what a trip. To think that elevator would lead all the way up here. At first, I couldn't believe it either. You saw the bidders down there, right? The ones who were all dressed up? No. There you go. This is how they get down there. That makes a lot oh, so more that's sense. that's how they do it. So does the Barracuda's head honcho live here then? Yeah. He's got the whole top floor rented out as his own personal palace. And that's not even half of it. He keeps all of his top dogs up here, too. If they're holding Akane-san captive, this is where we'll find her. This elevator only goes up to here, though. You mean we gotta switch to another elevator? Right. There's a guest elevator just outside. We can take that up. Follow me. Here she is! 
Hey, it's them. The guys who are stirring up shit underground. Seriously? Busted already? Hey, yo, hey, yo, man, fuck that. Don't let any of these assholes leave. No getting around them. Let's break through. All right. Sorry, it won't help. Show me what you got. So we're not... We're not even on the top floor? How high up are we? The hell is that gun? Something wrong? That's a weird looking gun. Um, anyone guard? No, no one's guarding. Uh, let's just use that on you? Sorry, I'm kind of like pushing into my attacks here. Man, I wish I had more money so I could start grabbing these people. I, I really want to see these two, but it's going to have to wait. God damn it. How do we get a discount on those? Do we have to keep using them to even get anything like that? Right, I'm going to do this. <laughs> well, pound name would have been pointless there. I can't even tell how high up we are. Okay, anything hiding? Ooh. Still have yet to use any of the attack items. We do have a basketball that does more damage than anything I could do right now. You have to keep that in mind for the boss. What was it, 600, 600 range AOE damage from a basketball? What is this? <clears throat> this looks familiar, oh, but also different than the original? What am I thinking of? There's a lot of... Huh. Oh, hold up! We can beat your ass! Let's do it! Okay. Punch! Oh, uh, table. Wow, that was a big AoE. Here go. You're in it now. Time to Hit him off. Do your worst! Ah! Oh, that guy's gonna die to bleeding now. Let's get it done. Let's just. And finish him. Bleeding? Oh, he lived. Oh. Sorry if I messed this up. Done. Guess I'm a fast learner. Wait, no, that said Eris. Is your job actually Eris? Oh my god, I can't look at her stats. Okay, it does say Eris right there next to rank 10. Okay. Unless, oh. Literally blocking it. Eh. Right there. Oh. There's an elevator just past here. We can take that up to the 15th floor. Okay. We're right behind you, Chi-Chan. Hey, do you really not have any doubts? About what? Everything I'm telling you. Who knows? Maybe I'm following the boss's orders and leading you right into a trap. That ever cross your mind? I told you he was keeping me in his room, remember? I mean, think about it. I ripped you off once already. For all you know, the elevator's packed with a bunch of dudes with machine guns or something. Well, we'll go from there then. I'm sure it'll work out. What? I'm serious. I made the decision to trust you after all. That bites me in the ass, so what? I really hope there's a guy with a machine gun in here. Okay. <sighs> What's up, Chi-Chan? Sorry, I made a wrong turn. Huh? 
This whole area kind of runs together, so I made a mistake. We need to go this way. Hurry. Uh, right. Uh-oh. Now I don't know what to think. Uh... We can't lose. I'm like blindly following Kitty uh, <laughs> Ichiban's logic here of believing in everyone he meets. Uh, so I have full hey, faith, but it's just a dead end. That was weird. Don't tell me you're lost. So you think, right? Now get a load of this. Whoa! The secret passage. Between this and all those lasers underground. Barracudas must really want to keep people out. You have to if you want to survive in Hawaii's underworld. In we go. Hmm. D should... <laughs> Did she just make the decision to... She was, what was she going to do? Was she going to lead us the wrong way and be like, Oops, I guess we can't find him? But then she realized Kasuga's trustworthy, and you seriously piss me. Bring it on. What was that about? Ready to rumble. Okay. I guess we'll find out eventually. Huh? <laughs> oh, oh, here we All go. Right. Everyone, grab a couch. Why? Why waste MP when you have that? Whoa. Speaking of Sifu, what the hell? <laughs> oh, shit. They're trying to gas us. Guess they're not messing around anymore. Fitness center, wave. Hmm. Kasuga, we can't stay in here for I long. Get ya. Uh, Roger, let's make this quick. Maybe you should wait what outside, Kiryu. You... Ready to rumble. Poisoned? Damn it. Even standing still wear me out. Right. We send these assholes packing, then make a run for it. We should probably heal yourself, actually. And kitty. Prepare yourself! I love spilling tea. Thanks, hey, yo. Thanks. Get apart. That's it a good sucks. heal, too. Oh, Damn. Well, Alright, we need to end this right away. Um what? that'll hit all three. And then, oh, gross. <laughs> oh, we'll see. I guess. I wish I could see before I click on it if they're weak to it. Like right here, uh, if I hover over it, I, I wish I could see that, but I can't. Got you now. Do your worst. <laughs> right. Time to you in hell. Imagine dying to being scrubbed. <laughs> Damn yeah. it. Felt good. <coughs> nope. Oh, we're good. <laughs> it spilled up the whole room. <laughs> Move your ass, Kasuga. <coughs> Keep dragging it along and you're good. But it's dead. What the hell did I just pick up? Ankle weights? Oh god, this sucks. This is really filling fill the uh, old JRPG vibe. Get out of the poison. Wait! Oh, I need to heal before this battle. Also, did I really just pick up ankle weights? I'm guessing it's gear. Greatly increase EXP obtained from battle and reduces max MP. Oh, that's a good trade-off. Anyone low on MP right now? Oh, you have zero. Okay, um, let me test this then. Oh, it cut it in half. I don't know if that's worth it right now. I'm not trying to be over level, but I, I, I'm glad that we have it. I'll keep it in mind. Oh my god, though. I lost... I lost 50 MP from that. I know I'm blocking it entirely. I... Oops. But, but still. Oh, speaking of that, <laughs> maybe you should get some MP back? Let's get you drunk, It too. works. Much easier to deal with poison when you're drunk. Yeah, okay. Not bad. Wait! What, like beef Right, time to throw down! See, this 
sorry if I her, messed this up. Her battle, her battle voice definitely has the Yuffie to it, but her normal, her normal t talking voice when I when I made her eat there, uh, was very much not Yuffie sounding. Which is great. She, she's got she's got a great, uh, distinct, but also multiple. Multi, multi voice. Uh, I actually don't know what, no what word to, to use there. But... Time to take out the trash. No, no, we're using beast mode. Oh, we'll see. I guess. Aim to start doing brawler mode for heat actions for him more often. Oops, I did not want to do that. Nope, I was late. Uh-oh. Ooh, that... I'm just not that hurts a bit. Alright, let's see if we can get him towards a wall. Can you get a heat action here? Sorry. No holding back. Oh, you get scared? Now that. Now nah, we're too far from everything interesting for heat action. Sorry about that. Oh. <laughs> Ooh. Okay. Looks like the gas hasn't made it this far. <gasps> I thought I was gonna die. <gasps> Should I open it? Thank God it's only locked into that Sweet. room. Even with the door open. Ooh, another running cap. Um. You have the weakest defense by far. You need you need something. Yeah. Okay, I'm going to save quick. And we'll pray that this is the last section, because we're nearing... Okay. We're nearing two hours now, so... Do we go back, or do we go now, or maybe take a quick break? Well, I just hope that this isn't another hour of un... Uh, of just cutscenes, uh, so we'll see, but... Okay, top floor. This is the door to the boss's suite. There's a good chance he'll be inside. And he calls the shots, huh? Must be a real scumbag. Let's make sure we're good and ready before we head in. Oh, damn. This is quite the setting. Hmm. That's a view. Pretty nice, huh? A perfect view of paradise. What's funny is until last century, this place was nothing but a taro field. You know that voice from the I could see. Agriculture was about the only industry keeping this island afloat. Then the white man came along and saw an opportunity. They crushed the fields, brought in sand by the boatload from sunny California. And what was it all for? Some fancy-ass resort built for some fancy-ass sons of bitches. That paradise you see, it's all smoke and mirrors from sea to shiny sea. Yeah, what's your point? It ain't obvious. <laughs> I'm saying a fake can hold more value than even the genuine article. Mm. Ichiba Kasuka. High time you met the head of the Barracudas. Name's Dwight. Dwight Mendez. <laughs> Immediately I know that voice. Nice to know I've made a name for myself out here. I actually hold quite a bit of respect for the Japanese people. About a hundred years ago, 
A number of your people immigrated to my country. They helped plow our farmlands and our country prosper. How about that? Nonetheless, I'm surprised you made it this far. That being said, it's not you I'm surprised with now. The real surprise is your spunky little friend. Eric? You got guts betraying me like that. Sorry, Ichiban. You know how I told you I escaped after they found me looking through the boss's study? That was a lie. The truth is, I actually got caught. And just in time, Kasuka. It was right as you barged in. So I gave Chitose here a choice. She could die then and there, or she could do me a favor. A favor? Remember what I said? About how I might be leading you guys into danger or a trap or something. That? I, am. Um, I meant it. What? She did. And it seems our deal fell through. She led you away from my trap. Hmm. And as a result, you ended up here. Face to face with yours truly. I see. I was at that elevator. All right. She said she made a wrong turn. Okay, we don't need to over explain. I may as well ask. Chitose, why a change of heart? Kasuga seemed like the better choice. Not much more complicated than that. I mean, have you seen how dumb this guy is? Huh? I've never met someone so sincere in my entire life. I had no way of knowing whether you'd keep me alive, even if I did follow your orders. Kasuga, however, is a different story. I don't think he's even smart enough to cheat someone. Gee, how nice. <laughs> really? Tell me this. Do you know what happens to those who betray me? <laughs> who gives? Dios mío, who would have thought? A Fujinomiya would be such a troublemaker. You must cause your parents a lot of headaches. How did you know? Did you expect me not to? The Barracudas have businesses with people all over the world. We would be remiss not to keep tabs on those in power. Besides, it was obvious from the start. The moment I first saw you, I knew you were just another spoiled brat. I figured I could use you. So I kept you around. <laughs> yep. I could kill Kasika and the others anytime. But I drew you in for one simple reason. Their death would have been on you. And few things are so obedient as a guilty conscience. So it goes, I suppose. Don't worry, I won't kill you. No. <laughs> I'll make you my bargaining chip. And bleed your family like a stuck pig. <laughs> you bastard! Appreciate the kind words, Chichan. Here you go again, Ichiban. You sure you're not mad? What for? I made the choice to trust you, remember? <sighs> you really are an idiot, you know that. All right, enough chit chat. <laughs> hey, 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 hang on. I still got unfinished business. Dwight. Remember the robbery that happened on October 7th, 2012? The target was Connie Tanaka, CEO of a well-known real estate company. On her way to visit a business partner, her car was attacked, and a bag of money was stolen. I don't think he and cares. what's that to you? I'm the one they took in for it, even though they had next to no evidence. Oh, you were the fall guy. <laughs> you saved me a lot of trouble. So you admit it? You sicked Roman on me. Had him pin your crimes on me. <laughs> hey, who can say? Dwight, there's something I want to ask too. You were looking for a woman named Akane, right? Be straight with me. You guys have already found her, haven't you? Only thing I'll do for you is offer you a way out. In fact, it's the quickest way I know. Cut to pieces and stuffed in a body bag. Oh boy. You know what this baby is? A machete. One of the most useful tools there is. 
It makes short work of the jungle, not to mention animals. And here in Hawaii, it's perfect for gutting fish. Bring it on! I think it's time I showed you what this blade of mine can do! Ready to I flee! I feel like there's a reference here. Oh boy, uh, uh, we've entered dynamic scene. Uh, oh. uh, Well, that was a good one. White Mendez. All right. Um. Okay. Oh, he's he's got backup. Of course he does. We saw him walk in, but hold on. There's a there's a I'm trying to remember the movie with the machetes. It's very very particular. I'm I'm going to look it up quick because I can't remember the name of this movie, but uh, it's just stuck there in the back of my mind, really bad right now. Wow, I just went on like a long trip sitting here waiting while taking in this song, obviously. <laughs> I completely forgot. Uh, so Danny Trejo has always been known as basically every everything that I've ever seen from him, I always reference machetes to it in some way or form. Like always. Because uh, one, in Spy Kids, and two, in the movie Machete. Uh, and... Uh, the fact the fact that they they're, they're just keeping it going they're, it's never gonna stop uh, and then I wanted to look up the, to VA to, to see if it was really him I think it is but he sounds so similar to Suruno from Gaiden that I was like is it you know because it sounds like Suruno Suruno might actually have done his VA I actually couldn't tell you I have to plug this in. Uh, I have to move up too. Super controller. I've been playing like for like eight hours today already, <clears throat> but yeah. <laughs> so let's let's get attack and agility up. I never noticed. I feel I feel like that VA for Seruno might have been trying to do Danny Trejo kind of like impression almost. Let's grand liner these guys over here. Get them out of here. Open wide! Get lost! Allow me. I did Wow, they have health! I didn't kill them! Ready as I'll ever be. I'm a sheriff. Um Yeah. He's weak to ice, my god. What's the hold up? That's unfortunate for you. Ooh, 80, 80. How am I missing? Oh my god, I'm hitting that so early. Whoops. Wait, maybe I can get them on my side. You guys wanna... Hit your boss? Oh, they don't wanna hit their boss. <laughs> okay, you two bone fell for it. Rip. Wow, I took a lot from the other guy, too. You don't have anything for Gar. Oh, you do. No, you might as well. So he can't guard for a while after this. Ow! I can do this. I don't. Yeah, he's too far away to heal. Damn. Oh come on, bring it. Let's go. Um, he's weak to electric right now, so I'll keep those two on him. And Kitty, you can finish this guy off. There we go. I finally blocked one. Let's get it done! Well, I'm waiting. Break yourself! Gonna get that some crit up. Hell yeah. 
Oh, that is so fast. It's not even that it's fast. I just don't know the point that it starts and ends. All right, this should hurt you. You have electric down times two. Okay. I won't break back. That's pretty decent. Time to All right. take out the trash. Time to go all out. Uh, this is, oh, I have no MP. Damn. Well, I'm gonna use this chance to. I'll take you on. Do I have a heal and? Okay, heal and MP. Uh, it's a jumbo way. It's fine. It's fine. Something wrong. What else am I gonna use it? This is what it's for. Here. Healing. Hey, thanks. And uh, maybe I should do scrub down again. I, can I missed. This. I missed. That's kicking time. No, no, hit him. Electric. Oh, ho, ho. there we go. Ooh. Oh, uh, what is this? You done it that now. would hurt. Time I return the favor. Are you gonna do that from the ground, sir? Um, he is. Guaranteed crit if... Okay, I'm gonna do this. Oh my god, it's so fast. Yeah, doesn't he sound like Saruno? Am I just crazy? Oh, you are so screwed. What did you do? Well, you have a grapple now. Kidu can take care of that. He removed his electric weakness, which I was relying on. That's unfortunate. Um, maybe I'll just hit him with a chair. I won't hold back. Get rid of this. Try harder. Oh. I didn't think I'd kill him. Oh yeah, power ring think too. I'm getting stronger. Hmm. Movement range expanded. Really? Learning more every day. Huh. Is Akane-san here or not? All right, all right. I'll be straight with you. We were looking for her, but she never showed up. If you don't believe me, feel free to search the whole floor. What do the Barracudas want with her? Honestly, I don't know. You're looking for her and don't even know why? It's not up to us. We got a request to look for her. We're just doing what we were asked. Request? Request from who? I don't know that either. They reached out to us anonymously. Sent it directly to my address. Mm. Seriously, info like that doesn't leak easily. And they sent a million dollars down payment. Damn. If we succeed, we would have another nine million coming our way. That's ten million just to find some woman. <laughs> sure, it was shady, but who would pass on that? Damn it. You don't know anything else? About Akane-san? About who the hell's chasing after her? If I knew any more, I would have told you already. Ain't that something? That's the most real thing you've said all day. I assume that about does it for all your Akane-san business, Kasuga? Yeah. Uh-oh. Great. 
Then I guess it's my turn. He won't do it. Don't do it. I mean, he's got to decide himself, but still, don't do it. <laughs> you give me a yes or a no. That crime I got locked up for. Was that you? Both the setup and bringing in a fall guy? It was your call? Answer me! Okay, okay! Yes, damn it! All right. So it was you. Do you have any idea how bad you fucked me over? And not just me! <sighs> wait, wait, stop, stop, wait, wait! Roman might be gone, but I can still wipe your criminal record easy! Just say the word! And I got money. A million. No, 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 ten million dollars! Oh, okay, okay. Hey, hey, that'll give you a clean slate. And then some! You'll be set for life! Like hell I will! <laughs> You think money's ever gonna bring my kid back? You think money's ever gonna bring you back? Okay, good. <laughs> Listen up. You know Chitose's name and face. You're gonna get rid of all the intel you have on her. She was never here. You got it? If you can promise me that, you're free to go. Well, it's your call! Uh, okay, okay, it's a deal. Uh, I'll get rid of everything, and I won't tell anyone either. Uh, I swear it, I, I swear! Uh, Damn, he's right. a badass. Just know, if you ever go back on your word, I'll put this thing right between your eyes. Oh, yeah. And this lovely little number here goes viral. That's my promise. <sighs> Well, I think that about wraps things up. Let's roll. You good now, Tomizawa? Honestly, I'd love to see him fry. But that it means sinking to his level. Plus, it's not like taking him out at spell the end of the Barracudas. We don't know who might leak info about Chitose, right? Better to leave him alive. Keep everyone else in line. But why do this for me? Because, believe it or not, you saved my life too. <laughs> I may not get why, but you still betrayed Dwight and led us right to him on top of it. We wouldn't be here without you. So, how about we call it even? Between you and Ichiban, I had enough debt as it was. I figured I'd strike one off the list. <laughs> when the hell do you get so cool, Tommy? <laughs> I've always been cool, smartass. <laughs> <laughs> uh, that was the first time he actually... <clears throat> uh, he was a badass there. My god, yeah. What a badass. That was that, that was that was great. That that couldn't have ended more like uh, I I every way that I hoped at, at the very least. Oh no, we're at 2 hours. You know what? I I do need to see what's going on. I cannot wait. <laughs> I really want to know. Huh. Pretty cool how we ended up here after going through a dump like District 5. How can you be so chill? We nearly got chopped up by the Barracuda's oh. boss with next to nothing to show for it. Now he's back to normal. The only one who got any business done was me. Yeah, but ain't that worth it? A win for you is a win for the team. Speaking of, our team just grew by one. Hello, everyone. Yeah, you got a funny definition of teamwork. Oh, is that how it's gonna be? I helped you in the end, didn't I? Yeah, and because of that, we're still breathing. 
You did us a solid there. My pleasure. It's nice to meet someone so open-minded. Do it. Play I the sound. I think Tommy here has his work cut out for him. <laughs> Damn it, Ichiban. You'll pal around with just about anyone, won't you? She did risk her life to save ours, even if it didn't start out that way. Besides, we want to find Akane-san. We'll need all the help we can get. Sounds like you're in my corner, then. Sure you won't ditch me the moment you find her? <laughs> I should hope not. Personally, I don't mind a loose cannon, as long as they're on my side. I suppose I should take that as a compliment. Ah, fine. I guess if anyone's guilty of anything, it's me. <laughs> I even held a gun at Ichiban at one point. You did? And you <laughs> ate the address. See? Even backstabbers like us can come around. Yeah, that said, it still doesn't mean I have to trust you. Or like you. Uh, why not? I like you, Tomy. Yeah, sure. You gotta be hiding something. And I'm gonna find out what. I can smell a secret from a mile away. Oh, come on. The girl's gotta have at least one good secret. Or two. Here, oh, why don't we just start over? <laughs> okay. But I'll be watching. One slip up, and it's over. I think he's. Watch me all you want. With looks like mine, I'm used to it. Mm. Ooh, she got you good. How you like that burn, Tommy? <laughs> Screw you. <laughs> Guess that settles it. Chichan, you're one of the gang. Good to have you. I think he's gone mad with power. Here. Don't tell me I'm supposed to make a speech now. <clears throat> the name's Chitose Fujinomiya. There. There we go. Oh. Such a good little join the party theme. Kasuga-san. Hey, that reminds me, you can have this back. Sorry about before. You stole my money? I didn't even know that. Thanks. Oh yeah, I wasn't broke, wasn't I? <laughs> it's been, what was that, like, episode four? Episode five? It was like ten hours ago. Oh wow, I nearly forgot all about that. Thanks, Juchan. Nah, it's nothing to, you gotta thank me for, honestly. You're way too nice, Ichiban. Okay, we did achieve what we all set out to do. It'd be good to get a new plan going. Go to Revolve. Uh, sure, then how about we go everything over everything we uh -huh. know so far? Alright, but instead of just standing around, why don't we go somewhere we can relax a bit? That's probably for the best. In that case, how about Revolve? I second that. We can lay low there, and we won't have to worry about anyone listening huh? in. Revolve? Uh, yeah, it's a bar over in Little, J Little Japan. We more or less use it as our hideout. I'm sure you'll like it too, Chichan. <laughs> huh, okay. Uh, it sounds like we got our destination. Roger that. We're off to revolve. Wow. It. We were stuck for, uh oh, for a full two hours that time. That was. There was a lot of good stuff happened there. Like. A lot of very cool scenes, a lot of. Uh, Stuff I expected and hoped that we'd get, like Chutose joining, uh, and it's just even better that I found out it's Susie Young, and like all I can hear is her voice now, and we're gonna hear a lot of her between this LP and <laughs> Rebirth, considering I'll be playing both of these side by side, so yeah, you'll get used to her voice. Ordering combo meals at a restaurant might trigger a table talk. Have we not been able to do this yet? Have I been ordering stuff for no reason? Huh. Oh, enemies with no with a blue icon are no threat and you can just press L2 to move on with your life. They wipe out all enemies, but you'll get less XP by doing so. But I won't have to fight them. I'll get XP for not fighting them. That sounds good to me. 
All right. That felt like a sufficient amount of story to the point where I do feel comfortable going and doing some side content now. Uh, the rest, like before, I was doing side content to maybe get like some mechanics uh, out of the way and get used to the game. Uh, but I really wanted to get some story, and I'm like very glad with what we got just now. Like I feel like we we finished an arc, so to say, so to speak, and, and it's a good time for me to you know be able to do stuff. It looks like we can walk around actually. If we can take a taxi, that means there probably won't be any cutscene for moving around. I may, like, I may do the usual, you know, gathering stuff, fishing, etc., whatever, tiny little things, uh, greeting people on the street. I may do that for now. Uh, but in the next one, I think at the beginning, I'll go back to Revolve to see where the story's going to lead us soon. But after that, I may... Yeah, because we're missing a lot of uh, sub-stories that uh, were available here during the day. So Drink if it changes later. it the day over, after going to Revolve, we will do side quests for two episodes, probably. Uh, and probably quite a bit of Sujimon, because I'd like to get some of that out of the way. Uh, yeah, there's, there's stuff everywhere here for Sujimon, so... They're all platinum, platinum rookie, gold. There are a bunch of trainers everywhere. I don't even know how it works yet. I have been avoiding this menu entirely until we actually, you know, got this done just now. So, uh, she's finally in the party. Tango for two tag team. Okay. I think the rest of these are all the same stuff everyone else gets. You got drink links, Bond Bingo. Oh boy. He has an official drink link we could actually go and do now, too. Uh, so I definitely want to. Th there's a lot to do. There's, there's a lot to do. I also probably want to upgrade this. Wait, strengthen? Like right here? Like right now? Oh, oh! you can't do it here, but you can, like, set it up to see how much money and, like, what you're able to get. Oh, that's actually really nice. I like that you could like, see what your current stuff will lead to before you go waste your time going to the upgrade shop. Huh. Okay. I'm going to have to upgrade her weapon for sure. She's got the best weapon so far right now. <laughs> All right. Well, I'm going to end this here. And, yeah. Next one, we're going to go to Revolve, see what's up, do side quests for a bit, and just kind of hang out, <laughs> more than likely. So, thanks for watching. Let me know if you like it, and I will see you in the next one.